So, what's going on, family? Welcome back to another edition of Crimson Truck Pride 2. We didn't get to make our trip to Louisiana because it was canceled. So, we end up coming back to work, getting a load that pick up and turn. I think it's a load of pipe and going to somewhere in Texas. So, we'll see y'all in a little bit. Yes, it's that time to get that diesel fuel. And today, the three diesel fuel done dropped down at 239. 239. I, I didn't see what it was from the get go. Uh, hold on, let's go to this other pump. Okay, the diesel was 245. So it dropped it down to 239 for cash price. So that's pretty good. So, you know, we're fixing to fill this thing up. We got to fill it up anyway to go to Texas. So let's get this filled up and let's ride. So we made it over here to the pipe place, which is American Pipe. We're just sitting in the bay waiting to get loaded. So I hope we get loaded and then we start on our journey. We got to tarp this stuff. So cover it with plastic and then tarp it. So uh, we'll see y'all when we get that done. So we done got this loaded, y'all. We've got the, we done covered it up and everything tarped it. But anyway, it was pipe. And also this is a tarping thing and what you have to do is take that net and that hook and hook them up on here in this case you know, do it on both sides in case you fall off on the sides but anyway we load it we give it a ride let's head to Texas y'all look at this out here I'm on some back road highway 62 um, there ain't nothing out here I mean literally nothing but cows and woods <laughs> I'm going to Quana, uh, Texas and it's going up like a back road but basically, as y'all can see, there ain't nothing out here. No truck stop. There ain't a cactus plant. Well, they might have something further down over that way. But it's literally nothing. So, I have no scenery. All I see is dead grass, uh, dead trees, and, and cows. That's it. That's all I get on this back road. So. We got about 93 more miles to our pickup, so hopefully we'll see some scenery. But other than that, we'll see y'all in a little bit. Alright y'all, here we start off day two on our way to uh, Texas. We'll be there sometime tonight. And of course y'all know it starts with coffee. So let's get this trip on the road. Alright, we'll see y'all a little bit. Okay y'all, we made it over here at the place Tenor Metal. Of course, we done got unloaded. Trailer's empty. And uh, they unload us and um, we didn't roll up our tarps, but we had some cuts in our tarp. We ended up putting these blankets right here on there. And it didn't protect the top part because we put tape on. We didn't have enough blankets. We had four blankets. And the top part, we just put tape around, but it still cut my tarps. Luckily, we had a patch kit to patch it up and uh, got, it back, got it back right for the tarps. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and get this stuff put up and we're going to roll out of here. We'll see y'all in a little bit.
Okay, family, we done made it here to a core hand. We got drop out trailer. I think they need loaded. And then I think they tarp it. We got to leave a tarp side. I think they tarp it and everything. And then we got to come back and strap it down. So, anyway, let's get our tarps out. Let's drop the trailer and we'll get back with y'all and let y'all know how this go. What is going on family we sitting out here just working on some stuff uh on crimson truck pride 2 just cleaning up some stuff um we end up not getting a load we got a load in uh where was it at uh in texas corhan texas but uh they end up it my tarps wasn't long enough because i had steel tarps and they wouldn't level it down put another row on the back so I ended up losing the load. So now I'm just dead heading back to Mississippi. Just chilling here in Louisiana. Through my 34 hours. Finish up the rest of the miles tomorrow. And that's about it. So sometimes you got to take the loss sometimes. You know, it's not always. But other than that, you know, we've been doing pretty good. So with that said, y'all. And also, we did install another air condition. A bigger one. Um, y'all can see it up there. Okay, that air condition that I had in there um, was an 8,000 BTUs. Uh, that's a 10,000. And yes, that joke would get cold. I had to turn it on low. The other one got cold, but when it was like 99 degrees to 100, it was cool. It was, you know, you could put up with it, but it wasn't cold. Where you said, dog, I got to turn this thing down, turn it off. I always had to have it on high and drop the tip all the way down. With that one, I put it on 72, 71, and still had to put it on low and cut it off so I was cold. So, other than that, that's pretty good air condition. Um, with that said, y'all, we're going to end this video. Uh, like I said, we don't have no load delivery Monday because we lost our load because the tarts weren't long enough. But uh, with that said, y'all, we're going to end this video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you smash that like button. Make sure you hit that share button. Also, make sure you subscribe. And with that said, y'all, roll tire roll, baby. For life, peace.